A Fox News alert, a wildfire burning through South Georgia today, now threatening to jump the state line into Florida. More than 140,000 acres burned so far, and the fire is only 12% contained. Residents urged to evacuate as about 700 firefighters battle the blaze. Jonathan Siri has more from Georgia. Jonathan? Yeah, Jenna, this is currently the biggest wildfire in the country and uh, the U.S. Forest Service's top priority. Now, the thick haze that was covering much of this area yesterday is finally lifted. That's driving up temperatures, which isn't helping firefighters, but it's also allowing aircraft to come in and drop flame retardant chemicals, helicopters scooping up water from local lakes to dump on the flames. Now, this area is sparsely populated, but that comes as little comfort to residents who live here. Some have chosen to remain in their homes to look after life. Livestock and property. We are in uh, conditions right now that uh, we're, we're absolutely bone dry, 100% ignition, unpredictable weather. Um, people need to get out when they're asked to get out. Now, you think of the Okefenokee as a swamp, but it's under severe drought conditions, exposing a lot of dry vegetation here. Now, at 6 o'clock tonight, the U.S. Forest Service and other authorities are going to be uh, meeting at the Baker County High School to answer questions and address concerns among local residents. Jenna? Jonathan, thank you.